now, today we're going to be showing you different types of sugars that you can make. And these make really wonderful holiday gifts. Yes. Or you can just use them while you're doing your baking for the holidays too. So we're going to start with about a half a cup of regular granulated sugar. This is our little, it's just a simple coffee grinder that we picked up, real simple. We use it for our herbs and, and that sort of thing. We're going to add about a half a cup of sugar. And then we're going to do some lavender. This is just our uh, lavender from our garden that we have hung up here in the kitchen and dehydrated. Add some of that. Oh, just, and you can add as much or as little as y'all want. It's really up to your own discretion. Okay. And Isabella is just going to pulse that in there. Let's take a peek. Yes, but we just choose to put it right into a jar. And now it, it smells absolutely wonderful. Yeah. And you can take a few of your little lavender pieces here and you can throw them in there on top. If you want, sprinkle some little buds in there. It just makes it cute. You don't have to. I think it's darling if you're going to give this as a gift. Mm -hmm. to have some of the little uh, bud pieces uh, laying throughout. Yeah. And there you have it. Your lavender. You just want to use a dry towel. You don't want to use a damp towel. You don't want to add, um, introduce any moisture to this. So we're going to wipe it out, get rid of most of the uh, lavender sugar out of there. I'm going to do about a less than half a cup here again of sugar. And then we're going to add these beautiful dehydrated oranges that we've dehydrated. You can do this with lemons. You can do it with oranges. Now these have the rind on them and we're just going to put him in there. I'm going to help him by breaking it up a little bit. I just think it helps. And you can do as many again or as little as you want. However fragrant you want to make this. Okay. Smells so yummy. Now this makes uh, your sugar very powdery mm -hmm. and very fine. Now, if you didn't want it this fine, you could simply take your oranges, grind them up in your, your coffee grinder, and then you could just add it to your sugar and mix it up that way too. So we're going to do a few oranges in here, just to add a little extra orange to the top of our mix it in. Now, as you can see, it grinds it up very fine and you can just add that to your sugar or in our case, we're adding it to our already spun sugar. And you'll just want to mix that around and give it some nice color. And if you wanted, you could always 
throw a beautiful dehydrated orange right on top. Our case, this isn't a gift. It's actually just for us here at home. So I'm going to leave it as is. But a beautiful dehydrated orange on top would be a gorgeous gift. Yeah. Now we're going to do a lemon one. I'm going to do this one just a little different so y'all can see the difference. I'm going to add about a half a cup of sugar to our jar. And then we're going to spin up some, some lemons. Oh my gosh, these okay. smell amazing. <laughs> now these are lemon rinds that we've um, dehydrated. I think we might have showed you guys that. Yeah. And we have some whole lemons down in here as well that you can throw in. We're going to do the rinds first. Okay, let's uh, get him out of there. And dump him in this. Yeah. And this is so beautiful and yeah. so yummy. You can add this to your baking products, anything that you're baking. You can add this right to it. So you can do as much or as little of this as you want. I know um, if you're baking a cake or something, you might want a little more than, um, you know, if you're just sprinkling it on top of some cookies. This would also be delicious to make a pound cake and put this in it. I know we use, um, Sometimes we'll do this, we'll do a glaze, and we'll use some powdered lemon for the glaze, and it is delicious. Now this is not been spun sugar, this is just your dehydrated lemons, and we pulsed them up and added them to it. So you can tell the difference. It has more... Uh, granules they're larger and the pieces you can see definitely see the pieces in it so there you have it a quick and easy gift set yeah who wouldn't want to receive something like this mm -hmm. for christmas this would also be delicious in your tea oh yes yeah. definitely in your tea you could flavor um Let's say you do the raspberries, just spin those up, add it to your sugar. You could add your raspberries to maybe a hot cocoa. That would be wonderful, wouldn't it? That would be. <laughs> As always, thanks for watching. Let's keep it simple. And fun. Also, subscribe like and hit that notification bell so you guys don't miss any of our fun videos and don't forget share it with your friends